Steve Waugh, one of the most successful test cricket captains in history. 16 years after retirement, Steve is heading back on tour. This time, swapping his cricket bat for a camera to take on a whole new challenge. I don't think it's a cover shot. Steve's ambition is to create a photo book to capture India's love of the game. Steve has organized a big name guest. The little master arrives. What cricket means to India? Uh, everyone knows how big football is in Brazil. You make that about only 10 times bigger in India. That is what cricket is for all of us. Yeah, that's the scale. Everyone follows, everyone enjoys the game. Uh, everyone plays also. You see these medans, they are full. Even the small lanes that you have between two buildings, there will be guys playing cricket. Uh, someone like me also chose to play cricket in the living room. And that is uh, how big the sport is in India. Everyone is obsessed. You want to all go out, play, and also when international matches are played, we appreciate, we discuss all the good and the bad performances extensively. You want to go into it details because uh, bad performances, uh, they, they change the mood of the nation, I would say. Uh, sometimes uh, you, know, you feel low and there are good days, you play brilliantly, the whole nation is celebrating. I remember in, in 2001, Australia came to India to play a test series. At that time, Australians had won some 16, 17 test matches in a row, which was phenomenal. And uh, it was reported that Steve had said that this is his final frontier. So, so that series became even more important for Australians as well as us. Uh, in the first test match, uh, they beat us convincingly by 10 wickets. And from second test match, second innings onwards, we started picking up in, in a grand style. You know, and uh, in the third test match also, we won. We won the series 2-1. Uh, without any doubt, I have to say, that was the best series of my life. But what people appreciated was the game was played in the right spirit. Though we were extremely aggressive and competitive, a lot of things happened. But we respected each other. There was mutual respect off the field as well. The cricket's in the mind, eh? Oh, I've had huge regards for Steve as a cricketer and also as a person. I am not at all surprised that people love him so much. Steve uh, has a special place in, in their hearts. You know, uh, he's, he's toured India so many times and he's, he's done well. And cricket is one element, but what he's been able to contribute as far as social causes are concerned, you know, that is also special. I knew, I mean, about uh, Steve uh, carrying his camera everywhere because you know, there used to be photographs where, you know, Steve would always have a camera around his neck. The rest of the guys are in shorts and looking around. But Steve was always capturing those moments. And I believe he's got a fantastic collection. You ever thought of me doing this, mate? That's a big one. Yeah. Thanks, pal. Photographs would be in thousands. Uh, it cannot happen if you're not passionate about it. And that is what Steve is. If he's passionate about something, he's going to go all the way. People value that. You know, uh, one thing is to contribute on the field and other element is to be able to do something for the society. And uh, he's, he's ticked those boxes. So people in India respect Steve and they, they like him. I've always believed sport has the power to unify people and uh, cricket exactly does uh, the same to our, our nation. It's a beautiful feeling.